Let's talk about the useful pipe command. And the pipe command, you can get to this by going to the uh, underneath the backspace key, hitting shift, and then you see the pipe command pop up in the uh, English North American keyboard. In other keyboards, it might be in a slightly different spot. So the pipe command can be really useful. If I type in get-help, then we can see it scrolls down many different pages all at once. So that's not very useful. But if I put in the get-help and then the pipe command and then the word more, just like you could do in a command line, then it takes me down one page at a time. And I can scroll through those pages by hitting the space bar. If I want to go one line at a time, I can just hit the Enter key. So you can have your choice whether you want to go a page at a time or you want to go a line at a time. So the pipe command also in PowerShell has even more powerful uh, uses. So if, for instance, I type in the get-disk command, it shows me a list of all my disks. But I can also type really complex commands using uh, PowerShell. So for instance, I can put in something like this, where we see get disk, then we have pipe, and then we have where partition style, and raw, and then pipe. So what it allows us to do is to separate uh, our verbs so we can add uh, additional uh, commands or just parameters. So if in the instance of get disk, get dash disk and then pipe where, that's a parameter. But if we go to the pipe initialize disk, that's a whole new command. That's a new uh, verb dash noun command that we can do. And we talked about the verbs and the nouns in uh, one of our previous videos in this playlist, which you can check out. So it'll, the pipe command allows us to do many different commands uh, all on one line or in one uh, command string. Now, we can also use it one more way, and that is we can type in get disk and then just the pipe command. And we hit enter, and what it does is it gives us the ability to type in, because that first uh, command that I just typed was really long. So what it allows us to do is to do one line at a time. So I can type in the next command, then I can type in the one after that, all the way until I get to the very end, and then it will go ahead and format the disk for me. In this particular case, that's what we're doing, is formatting the disk and uh, with all of these other things. So it's getting any disk that's raw, it's going to assign a drive letter, et cetera, et cetera, until we get to the end. So the pipe command uh, is, is very powerful in PowerShell because, as I mentioned, uh, it not only allows us to block the pages from scrolling all the way to the bottom, but it allows us to add parameters and additional uh, verb noun PowerShell commands uh, between each one without having to do them one at a time.